Hello everyone, Kenneth here with another short painting video. So I recently found this figure of Spider-Gwen from Thingiverse, sculpted by this guy called Obieteru Kabugo, uh, links in the description. Liked it a lot, so I decided to print and paint it. The original figure size was much larger than the base plate of my 3D printer that I was using, the Anycubic Photon S. So I ended up shrinking it to 60% scale, that's almost half its original size. It ended up at 9cm from head to toe. The sculpt comes in three hollow parts unsupported. The sculptor did an amazing job and it's super detailed. The fitting was also quite good, which is actually more than I can say for some of the other sculpts that you can find online. Um, hollow parts in general, if you don't know, saves resin, but because I shrank it, some of the parts that were already thin became much thinner and did not print perfectly. You can see some of this uh, artifact on the side of the hood. Um, one large issue I faced was with the separated leg. When curing, I must have done something wrong because it kind of started to warp a little bit. The fitting ended up uh, bad and there was a large gap at the joint from the leg to the body. I eventually had to use super glue and a lot of green stuff just to fill the gap and smooth the surface. To be very honest, I've not painted in a while as you can tell from my last upload and I did not feel like I did this model justice. I fumbled with my airbrush a lot and my attempt to simulate light uh, ended up very poor so I just decided to paint everything normally. Uh, the largest problem or hurdle I faced with this was the webbing details. My hands weren't stable enough to paint the webbing across her biceps. Even with my triple zero daughter brush, I was barely able to get the lines sharp enough, let alone attempt the uh, webbing inside a hood if you can see. Anyway, I think this turned out okay for a two hour job. I hope you enjoy watching the time lapse. Uh, let me know what you want to see me do in the future, because sometimes I get lost creating random content. If you like this video, hit the like and subscribe button, and if you don't, well, you know what to do. This is Kenneth, and I'll see you on the next video.